Hello everybody, I'm Nasty Mold and there has been yet another beta update and oh my god, I am so excited about this one. I can't wait to show you. Oh, it is so cute. So there are a few things that have changed, not a whole lot. We finally get our ultimate cape back. We can take a peek at that. Looks like it's been improved on quite a bit. And we have a different cape added and I have to say, I think it's my favorite. It is so well done. Okay, let's get it. So this cape can be obtained from the Tumbling Troublemaker. Do you see what I see? That is a new and improved full-on raccoon cape. I am so excited. I'm so excited. It looks so good. You can also see that the ultimate cape has been re-added. It's still creepy looking. It still gives me Bloodborne vibes. And it looks like it's available for two hearts. So we should still have the mask coming as a second ultimate reward. There are no hearts yet. So there is absolutely no way for me to actually purchase it and try it out. But finally, what we've all been waiting for, the raccoon cape. It looks so much better than I expected. If you saw the earlier version, it looked really big. This one... There's the front, it has little pom-poms, super cute. And from the back, it's disconnected. It's not connected to the top part, so it's actually a little tail stuck in your back. That is adorable. I genuinely think this might be my favorite cape in the game right now. I am so excited to actually wear this in the live version. It is so good. I guess let's take a look at what it looks like walking around and flying because that could be kind of weird, but I feel like they've fixed it up quite a bit already. Yeah, it's pretty normal. It just reminds me of any of the other cape styled, um, capes, <laughs> scarf styled, I mean. It is so good. And the way it bounces when you walk. We're so fluffy. Boing, 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 boing. Ah, Rakakuni. We've also got the other capes, of course. We have the bear one. This one here. And then we have the ultimate reward, which it looks so purple in this light. That looks incredibly cool. I'm actually very excited to try this one out and have it in different realms because it looks very different depending on the lighting you're in and we'll go somewhere a little bit brighter i also love they took off the upper part because it reminded me way too much of our past few capes they all had that upper part on them with the um wounded warrior he had one of those hang on we're putting on a raccoon cape you can catch me at those little shop pretending to be tom nook <laughs> All right, before we finish off this video, I want to try that ultimate cape in a different form of lighting because obviously home space is pretty dark. So here we are in the prairie. It's quite bright. We'll see what it looks like. I am absolutely going to the wrong closet. Over here, capes. Let's see. Oh, it's a little bit more like pinky, sunsetty looking in this light. I am so curious about this one. I wonder if they're going to change it more. I actually like the color of it, but I can see that some people might not. Hmm. I think it's such a unique and cool cape. I think maybe I do wish it was a little bit darker. Like this was the ultimate darkness cape we had in the game. It would be really cool looking, but I'm also okay with the colorful gradient. I think it's really neat. And yeah, I think that is it for this video. I don't have too much else to share. I am super excited for this season. I can't wait to see the masks again and see how they've changed, how they've improved. And yeah, that is it. Thank you guys so much as always for watching. I hope you found this helpful and I will see you in the next video. Bye bye. Mimi, 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 mimi,